Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mecha Monk. Welcome back to your daily dose of Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Last time we completed the post of notes with Isaac. Look at that. That's some uh, good shit. Let's um, let's see what else we got to do here. Pretty much every character needs something. Well, every character obviously needs something besides Isaac. Let's go with random. Make sure we keep an eye out for what we need. Alright, Judas. Judas needs a dark room clear. So I guess that is going to be the objective of this playthrough. Standard, uh, standard Judas strat will apply. Don't get hurt. Get health ups. Trade away health for devil deals. Rinse, repeat, lather as needed. Straight up, Blood the Martyr is a very good start for a first room item, first floor item. Nice damage up is going to help. Let's see, yeah, we're, we're like halfway through the damage stat on the start menu anyway. Although that fucking stat is never reliable. It's not true. I don't know what the deal is with it, but, you know, whatever. I'm going to go in here. I thought, huh, I thought maybe we'd find a bomb. I wanted to buy a bomb. We'll, we'll buy the Spirit Heart instead. Because there was these Tinted Rocks, one there and one there. Still could probably pick up a bomb before the end of this floor. It's possible, at least. Yeah, Mr... or not Mr. Mega. My bad. Wrath could actually give us some bomb-related items. Usually does, in fact. Uh, Mr. Mega's not really what I'm looking for. However, if I do get a Mr. Mega... Nope, no Mr. Mega. I was gonna say I'd use it to blow up the rocks and then get, book up a Lyle, but... Oh well. No use really talking about that anymore. I was gonna say, why is my head so big? Then I remembered we have the, uh, the Liberty Cap down there in the corner. Alright, gold chests are not really what I'm looking for right now, but... Thank you, game, I guess. Actually, fuck you, game. Oh, uh, I was trying for a key. <laughs> Low probability that was gonna happen, but whatever. Damage is absolutely wonderful already, which is just just perfect. Um, Book of Belial will uh, even give us more damage when we need it, and I think we're off to a very good start. Very good start. Man, this would have been a good room to use that bomb, those bombs in. Fucked up, I guess. Uh, I don't remember, do we get... I don't think we get a double deal on this first floor, though. Regardless of our Book of Belial buff... buffage. But hopefully we get a health up or something. A health up would be nice here, just so we can get ready for it on the next floor. Um, devil deal, that is. Something that gives us a health up and a spirit heart would be awesome. Soul heart. I don't... what... there is definitely an item that does that. I think maybe the bandages. The bandage? Oh, we just got dog food. Oh, well, let's just continue right along. We'll be able to get that Tinted Rock chest combo, but oh well. Curse of the Blinds. Not the best curse when we're expecting a Devil Deal, I have to admit. However, hopefully it's not that bad. Most of the time you can guarantee that... oh, shit. Most of the time... You can guarantee that it's going to be a good Devil Deal. Or you're going to get a good item as a Devil Deal, so it's usually worth the risk, even if you have Curse of the Blind, I'd say. Fuck, getting really messed up by those guys. Uh, so yeah, we'll take, we'll probably take whatever we find if we even get to that point. Jeez, hemorrhaging health right now. Those guys were speedy. There we go, got a little bit of HP back though. Hopefully we can pick up a bomb or a soul hearts. Bomb being the logic behind the bomb wish is that I could get blow up a tinted rock. So it's kind of a roundabout way of saying I want a soul heart. Ace of spades. No, I want to keep a liberty cap. I like liberty cap. Give us a little bit of augmented tear fix every once in a while. Ace of Spades, I think that'll let us draw, let us find cards better, which can be good. Card, the playing cards are pretty awesome. Uh, huh, I was gonna go back and test the first secret room by over there by the uh, curse room, but for that to really be worth it, I need another bomb. 
So maybe if we get another bomb, we'll go back there and try that. Try that one out. Hey, there's our item room. We'll go in there at the earliest convenience, which is as soon as I clear out these turds. Rainbow poop. Not much I can use that for just yet. Hopefully... Oh, man. I... I hmm. I actually really like Whipworm. I think I might roll with Whipworm. Ghost Baby. <clears throat> I might roll with Whipworm over whatever we just had, uh, Liberty Cap, because I like that. I like being able to really shoot those tears out. Gets your target super fast. Lets you hit things a little bit easier. And if we can get a tear shot speed up or something, it can be pretty deadly. Rate of fire up, that is. Did I see... I think I saw a Tinted Rock back here. Was there? No. No, I think that's just some screen glitter acting a bit weird. Nothing else to do here. Let's just keep on going. Oh, Larry Jr. fucking me up a bit. Luckily, you know, Bookable Isle. Guaranteed Devil Deal. Not gonna have to worry about taking that red hard damage. Evil range and shot speed up. That's that's nice. Uh, so we don't know what we're gonna be taking. Let's just go for the middle one. Headless baby. That's a utter shit. Uh, I'm tempted to take another one just because that one was so bad. Mm, yeah, goat head. Not what I wanted to get. Could end up being really dumb. I don't I don't know what that was, but huh. Okay, I guess we're rolling with one black heart. Hey, at least we'll be getting double devil deals now. Oh shit, we're dead. Uh let's just restart, I guess. This is gonna be a little bit of a long episode with such an early death. I shouldn't have taken two devil deals. That was a misplay. On my part. Charm Tears. Kind of a uh, cool power-up, I guess. If, if we can get it to proc reliably. Which is probably not going to be the case, honestly. Yeah, so that was a dumb play. Oh well. Maybe you're still sticking in there. Hopefully you didn't abandon the video just yet. We'll try to get far. We're not going to restart again. If we die on this run before we get too far, it's just going to be game over for this episode. Unfortunately. But, let's not make that... I'm going to try hard not to make that the case. Little buddy helping us out there for a bit. Thank you, bomb. Fighting Steven. Oh god. That's not good. Low health right now. Hmm. Don't want to end the run right now. Come on. He's charmed. Doesn't do anything. Oh my god. Ugh. I guess we will restart. I mean, that was hardly... Hardly any progress. Hmm. That's the risk you take when you play as Judas. I mean, the low HP, low initial HP, can definitely cause you to die pretty easily. Uh, this is kind of a shitty episode, huh? Well, okay, that's a little good. I certainly won't start again if I die one more time. I mean that for real this time. No matter how far we get. If I die in this floor, the episode's gonna be over. Sorry to say. Sorry to say. But that's just the way it's gonna be. Because I'm going to get pissed off. This blue dude over here hopefully drops a, another soul heart. That guy blew himself up, I guess. No, no soul heart drop doesn't look like. What is he blue tinted? What is he tinted blue for then? If no soul heart. It's some bullshit. Uh, by the way, Miner's Cap. Good, uh, good early game pickup. Good early game pickup. Uh, you know, not as bad as if we had gotten that with another character who has lower initial starting damage, but because Judas starts with a little bit more damage, 
Getting a utility item like this on the first floor isn't so bad, I don't think. Useless. Useless, although that freaking, uh, that room on the last run saved my ass so hardcore. If you didn't see, if you haven't seen that episode, go back and check that out. That was some cool stuff. I won't spoil it all, I guess, if you, uh, haven't seen it, but in the clutch, got one of those secret rooms and pulled off a victory. I guess I kind of spoiled it, didn't I? But, whatever. Monstro, not, not tough to fight. Caffeine pill. I actually like the caffeine pill. It's not the best upgrade, but uh, a little extra speed definitely helps a bit. And the size down also helps with our hitbox. And look, we got a I can see forever pill, which uh, turns out to be a little useless. Hmm. I don't think I want to buy anything there. Shit, I didn't mean to give that to the key beggar. Oh well. Uh, let's keep on going. Keep on keeping it up. Keep on, keep on, keep on getting it. Something like that. Isn't there a song that goes like that? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Bad, uh, bad pop, pop culture references right now. Oh, I think we'll check this out. Uh, instant regret. Those uh, are all bad. Pretty bad trinkets. We will take Ace of, Ace of Spades or whatever, though. Might as well. Umbilical Accord is... Shit, I don't even know what it does, honestly. Red Patch, also don't really know what it does that much. Two of Hearts, okay, so the uh, the heart cards are already... Not the heart cards, but the uh, cards, playing cards are already dropping. Two of Hearts, uh, useless at the moment. A little bit of extra cash there. Not, uh... Not too helpful. This guy's gonna blow up when he dies, I, I believe. Yeah. Drop the bomb for us, too. Plenty of bombs. I like that. I like having uh, all the bombs we want. I only have one right now, but I've had lots of drops, is what I meant to say. What The message I'm trying to convey, hopefully that accelerated drop rate keeps up. Since we have uh, the miner's helmet, we'll be able to bomb our way in there. Infestation is pretty decent. Not really the best item, once again, but uh, yeah, hopefully it'll it'll be, help us out a little bit. I, although I don't I don't remember exactly what the mechanic is with it. Do we have to get hit for them to trigger? If that's the case, then it sucks, but if it's just the one that sometimes procs with fly spawns, I'll, I'll be happy with that. Oh god. That was shitty. Lost our soul heart. Let's not get too bent up, bent out of shape about it though. I'll blow up this rock. Hey, some more heart, some more cards here. And I'll stay with the chariot. Check out what's in here too. Man, um, these shops are kind of falling flat. What's this one? I can see forever though. Uh, by the key as well. Hmm. Let's use the, let's just use that I guess, and we'll use it to go into the top secret room on this floor, and we'll keep our chariot card. Maybe I should have saved that pill for the next floor, but I wanted to take the chariot with me. Although I might end up just using it on this boss or something. Oh well. At least we'll get to go in there for free, and not use a bomb. I wonder what it could be. Bunch of useless red hearts. I do wish I had a bomb now to blow that up. Pop our book of Belial and go to town on Larry Jr. It's the second time I've faced you now since I died. Already. Twice on this run. This is a bad run. Lots of deaths. Ruining our win streak of one or whatever the hell it was. Uh, what do I do in this situation? I'll tell you that in just one second after I handle these spiders. We're gonna take Dark Bum, and we're also gonna take Child of the Night. I know this is exactly Spirit of the Night, not Child of the Night. 
Now this is exactly what I did last time to kill myself, but check this out. We got flying now, so we're gonna get that shit, number one. And number two, did you remember about this room? Maybe you didn't, but here it is. Dark Bump's gonna buff us up a bit before we leave the floor. Just like a good little Dark Bum should do. No! Aw oh, man, I fucked that up, actually. Ah, oh, okay, it didn't turn out to be that bad. No, I, dude, I don't need a fucking Spider-Man. Fuck off with that shit. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So, unlike last time, that actually ended up being a good play. For now, at least. We'll see how it ends up in the long run. Hopefully I can get a HP up uh, sometime before the next Devil Deal. That way I don't have to trade away these Soul Hearts that I just picked up. That would be ideal. That would be ideal. No, not worth it to go in that chest. Hmm. Dodging these dudes. Dark Bum's hanging out over by them, he's, although he's not doing anything. That black one I think is going to blow up. It shouldn't really be able to hurt me if I stand over here. Yeah. secret room over there. I'm not sure that I want to go in there. What else? What can I really get from it? I guess uh, maybe there, there's a possibility there would be like a one-up or something. But I might wait until uh, to see the to see the other room. The top secret room. Let's see where that one is. Full health. Useless right now. Health up? Okay, there's, uh, there's our HP upgrade that we wanted. That's very nice. Very nice. Perfect. I like where I like the foundation that we're laying down right now for this run. Much better than the last time. All I can hope for is no curse of fucking darkness, because I got a lot of glare on my screen right now. I got my got my blinds closed, but in the day like this, when I'm recording this episode, not that you would know any other way unless I told you just now. The sun still gets in. I need to get better bl uh, blinds or something. Although the people at my apartment complex, like they told me. I'm not allowed to have blinds that aren't white on the outside. On the outside. So maybe if I got... I don't know how that's gonna work. Like, black blinds that have white on one side? That would definitely block out more light. Not sure. Not sure. I don't think anybody would be able to tell if I had black blinds. I'm so high up. You'd have to really be looking to see that. Might be able to get away with it. Though the blinds that I have are like those kind that uh, they slide and like you twist the li the lever the, the you twist a little rod and then they close one by one. I'm not really sure how you replace those or if I should even really fuck with that. I don't I don't know about that. Abel is pretty bad though. Not too excited about picking him up. Holy shit! I'm popping the book of Belial. No, no, I should have just done this. Oh well. Waste the Book of Belial charge, but not how much of a waste is it really? Yeah, not at all actually, since we just picked that up. The fanny pack, I don't care so much about. I'm gonna go with that instead. And we're gonna come down here and blow our way into here. Alright, I like that option. It's pretty nice. Mm -mm -mm. Do I want to go into this room? Yeah, I guess. I already put the bomb down. It's too late to decide otherwise. A bunch of money. Don't really need that for this floor. Maybe on the next floor, though. If we end up going to more shops. Which we will. We will. If we got keys, I guess. And we got the money for it. We definitely will. Although, if we're pushing our luck with the shops. We're going to about to be running into greed eventually. Although, how many sh shops have we actually gone to on this particular run? I, I forget since, since I respawned twice already. Hey, that's our regeneration. Forgot we had that. <clears throat> Glad we got a little bit of a bomb recharge there. Oh man, we got plenty of money. Flying just makes everything better. You can get every item that you encounter, so you can just fly over all the barriers. And, uh, yeah, you're just gonna get richer, you're gonna get more consumables, you can dodge shit. Uh, with the Spirit of the Night, we get the Spectral Tears, so we can chill out behind rocks and stuff and avoid taking damage altogether. 
Ah, I like where this is going. I do. Hopefully, it's enough to let us defeat the Lamba. If we get... I feel like very often, oftentimes, on the Dark Room, there is a Red Hearts room. Red Heart Top Secret room. So hopefully we'll be able to get that again right before the final boss and feed all of it to Dark Bum. That would be ideal. These fucking spiders. These guys are pretty tough, actually. When there's two of them, not so bad. But I remember that we had four of them? That was that would have been hard if we didn't have uh, the Chariot card. A lot more money. These bats. This bat room can suck as well if you don't have a way to dodge them. Luckily, flying takes care of that need. If you can't take them out fast enough before they get to you, it's like, what are you going to do? They're just going to corner you and fuck you up. Another Bumba. Don't like fighting Mega Fatty just because how long he takes. He's not too hard, except for that jump that he does. Makes him teleport on top of you, practically. Some bullshit when that happens. With uh, the help of Book of Belial, we're doing a lot of damage, though. This isn't too bad. Hey, look, Abel's even getting some damage in there. It helps, I guess, when you're fighting a centralized enemy like this. He can actually help out a bit. He's a pretty shitty familiar, though, all things considered. Dead. And there's the Devil Deal that we like to get. Oh, but it's Krampus. Uh, I don't like fighting Krampus. Well, I don't mind fighting him, but I don't... Uh, it's not the Devil Deal that you want. And that we deserve. Quite frankly, we deserve better! Oh, just walked right through that laser. Maybe we don't deserve much better. Hopefully, all I can say is hopefully that we get the, uh, the lump of coal and not Krampus's head. Yeah, nice. We've been real damn lucky getting uh, Krampus's head all the time. Or, not getting Krampus's head all the time. Then uh, picking up the lump of coal almost every time. Can I say time once more? Maybe. So, Curse of the Unknown, but I do happen to know that we have a lot of, uh, a lot of soul hearts, and we now have two red hearts at our disposal. But, uh, wait, oh, shit, that was, uh, careless. Very careless. Do we, um, do we, though, uh, I don't know why I can't remember this, I should have been paying attention to the last couple floors, but does the Book of Belial give us Devil Precedent, even if we already had... I'm taking that, I like the extra speed. Uh, does it give us Devil President even if we had it on the last floor? I hope that it does, because I would like to go again. A Sapa. I'll bomb our way in here. See what we got. No, no, it's a bunch of shit. A bunch of bullshit. But we had enough uh, bombs to make it worth it. Make the effort worth it at least. Plenty of money. Definitely gonna check out the shop. See what lies in there. Probably a big fat motherfucking greed or something. Who I will be displeased to fight, but I will do it begrudgingly. This is already feeling like a pretty long run, but that's uh, because I've restarted now twice. It's gonna be a long episode. The last episode actually came out to be like an hour long. I couldn't believe it. We had awesome damage with like Polythemus and a bunch of other damage ups, but it took forever for some reason. I think it was just because, like, the shot speed is so slow. The DPS was terrible, but the damage damage per shot, <laughs> not to be confused with DPS, damage per second. Our damage per shot was high, but the DPS damage per second was so low. So it took us forever. Did pull off a nice little victory, though. Finishing off Isaac's post-it note. Holy shit. Wow. A lot of damage. Damn. That's probably negated that soul heart we picked up. Ended up being just a waste of bombs, if you think about it. These fuckers. Running so fast. Just try to take them out before they regenerate. It's hard when there's a bunch of them. These enemies can be a pain sometimes. 
cool uh, cool mechanic though with the regeneration. I'm glad that they re extended that mechanic to champion versions of enemies. It's pretty neat. Man, that glare is awful right now. A Curse of Darkness will end the run, almost. I'm worried about it. That's why I just gotta stick to playing this at night. So in the secret room, let's check out what's in here. A bunch of pills. Luck down, that's not good. Health down, that's not good. 40 hour energy, that's decent. Telepills. Not the best. I guess, though, it'll save us a bit of backtracking since I would need to find the item room before we leave anyway. I'll probably end up taking the I Can See Forever pill onto the next floor just so we can go into those places for free. Hey, look, a, uh, it's a library right there. I'm not worried about the library, actually, because I already have Book of Wild. I don't want to. I don't want to trade that for anything. Unless there's like a Book of Revelations in there, I could use real quick. But that's unlikely. Where the hell is the item room? It must be over here somewhere. Yep, there it is. Oh man, this is a shitty room. Thank God we have flying though. Thank God we have flying. This would be very bad if we didn't have Spirit of the Night. I'd already be taking a lot of damage. Still probably, yeah, yeah, so I am gonna take damage. Just, oh man, a lot of damage apparently. These dudes are just so annoying to fight. It's the waiting game. Dead. Let's get our reward. What's it gonna be? Mom's Brawl. That's... That's a disappointment. Oh well. Let's keep it going. Fight the boss. Get our devil deal. See what it is. Should have two red hearts, if I remember correctly. 40 hour RNG. Uh, da, 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 da. Don't care about 48 hour energy, really. Let's just take the I Can See Forever pill. Fighting some Chad. Chad. Love you, buddy. I, I actually, I don't know why I said that. I don't love Chad. He's uh, not a hard boss, though, by any means. Just chill out over here. If we had some bombs, we'd be feeding them to him, but we don't have enough to really make that a viable strategy. That took some bad damage, but we still are plenty shielded for the devil deal. Wait, was that our first time fighting Chad? I find that hard to believe. Don't need Lord of the Pit. Um, since we already have flying. I think I might just take uh, Gimpy. Gimpy's not really the best pick up there. A little late for me to be hoping for Guppy though, and I don't really need to use Guppy's head for anything. There's that Curse of Darkness I didn't want to get. Shit, I cannot see a thing. I can see that secret room. No tinted rocks here? Alright, let's go. Oh, there's our greed fight. Hopefully this means we won't run into him in the item, uh, in, the, in the shop. But I don't know that that's a guarantee, necessarily. I think sometimes you can end up fighting him twice. Plenty of money. Plenty of money to spend on something good. Oh, that was a uh, shit. Damn, let me see. I wonder if I can turn up the brightness on my TV. Bear with me just a second here. Yeah, 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 here we go. Oh, okay. That makes the game look awful, but at least I can see. I'll, I'll have to turn that back down after this room is over with. This floor is over with. It's just I can't I can't play with. Oh shit! Oh shit! The menu popped back up over. <laughs> Get out of there. Okay. Thankfully, I thought fast enough to pause it. I feel like this is a bit cheesy. What I just did, turning up the brightness on my TV, but fuck, dude. The glare is just too bad right now. Get in there, dark bum. Thanks, bro. Oh shit. 
It looks like almost normal, just like hazy. I know it's not gonna come through in the recording, but yeah, I need a better TV or something if I'm gonna not do stuff like that. Just picked up Leo, which um, is a little interesting for what we got going right now. We can fly, so it's not gonna be too much of a benefit for us in the way of like uh, making bridges or anything like that. However, maybe we can uh, find some some secret trapdoor black market deals. Oh god, man, my dodging right now is going insane. I don't know what to do. We're able to keep our health up with uh, Little Chad paying out with Red Hearts and Dark Bomb converting them into Soul Hearts. That's actually a nice little synergy. Oh, that was shit. Hemorrhaging HP, but, like I said, we're being able to keep it up, so that's nice. It's a good uh, long-term strategy. I, I need to, I still need to increase our damage, though. Damage is not where I would like it to be for an endgame run. Not that we're endgame quite yet, but we're getting close to that, that point where I really need to be doing some more damage to be comfortable with finishing this run. Finishing on top, that is. We'll also use Stompy to run over any skulls we find. If we find them. Two Isaac heads in one room. That's rare. Uh, Ringworm is kind of cool. Ringworm is kind of cool. I don't know if I really want to keep it though. Nah, nah, fuck that. Whoa. Fuck this, too. Uh, a lot of damage. Those mat. This is such a tough enemy to fight. Just wanted to check our damage real quick there. This, uh, this floor has been not really the best, honestly. I'm glad we found a key there, because I, w I want to go to the shop whenever we find it. Oh, Rainbow Baby. That's interesting. 48 hour energy. Bad gas. I guess we'll keep 48 hour energy. No reason not to, at this point. Not the most useful, but whatever. I wonder. Can, I don't think we can use Book of Belial twice and get double damage. Maybe we'll try that if we get to like a boss with that pill. If we hold on to it that long. Alright, Dark Bum, go crazy, man. Thank you. Oh, we used a... Did we use a we can, I Can See Forever pill? I guess we did. Just chill out over here. Uh, I don't like these dudes. There we go. Break these guys up. Judgments. Yeah, we could use that. Might as well use our Hogalaws, speed this up. Basically guaranteed to have a judgment payout with the amount of money we have. We ended up getting the fanny pack. Uh, again, I guess the game wanted us to have that. And Dark Bomb's gonna be feasting right now. This should get us to full health, I think. Pretty close, at least. Two more. Can we get two more? Let's see. There's one. Oh, <laughs> I didn't mean to put a bomb down there. Nope, okay. Oh well. It's okay, we got plenty of HP. Which is very nice. Fighting Chad. Uh, I just want to use that. We'll be able to get another charge before we fight the boss. Just wanted to speed this up a bit. 
really still need a damage up, man. What are we gonna get to get a damage up? Would love to get the mark or the pact or hell brimstone. That's a lot. That's a tall order, but I still would like to get brimstone or something. Uh, what else? Might take mom's knife if it was presented to me. Not the hugest fan of mom's knife, but can't deny its its damage, pro its properties of damage. Flying dudes get a little bit too close for comfort. Bomb flies. It's this red one. I would not be able. There's no way I'd be able to see that red one if I hadn't turned up the brightness a bit. Speed down. That sucks. Mm, wow. We don't need any of this really. Let's see what this gives us though. Telepills, bad gas, health up. Okay. And health down. Don't want to take health down. Let's uh, let's use the telepills. Great. Now just, just that just costs a bunch of backtracking. Um, we'll go back and pick up the 48-hour energy and roll with that going forward. The little health up is nice, just because now let's donate some of our money too. By the way, it's nice because we'll be able to take a two-heart deal and a one-heart deal that is what we get presented with. Could buy that spirit heart, but well actually I, I couldn't. I don't I got any room for it right now. Which is a good thing. One more dude left. Boom. Uh 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 I don't even remember what Florida is on the devil, devil uh, deal, shindig. Oh, okay. I didn't even realize we had killed the boss or those enemies. We just slipped right into the boss room. Hollow's not putting up much of a fight, and I don't expect it to at all. Just take him out. Hopefully, we get a good item from this. And we did, we got, well, I don't know if that's really the best item, the spoon. But it makes up for that health, that speed down we picked up earlier. So, not really the devil deal that I was hoping for. Hey, goat head. That's kind of cool, I guess. We'll get, that means we'll get a few more devil deals at least. Yeah, so we'll, we'll get two more devil deals, so that's good, that's good. Alright. And turn down my brightness a bit if you just bear with me for a second. Yeah, there we go. Get it back to normal. That's good. Hey, actually, actually looks better than it was before. I left that up, left the brightness turned up a bit, but I actually like that. A little bit more saturation, I feel like. This has been Mecha Monk's TV brightness discussion. I know it's riveting discussion. Wow. A bunch of useless money. I don't know. I don't think we're going to get a chance really to spend all that. I will make a point to try to find the shop, though. Get in there and see if there's anything good. Shops have been pretty bad, though. Honestly. For the most part. Monkey Paul. Don't care about that. Let's keep our speed up. Fuck this room. I just want to get it over with faster. That's why I'm going with the Book of Belial. Hey, Dry Baby! That's awesome! I love Dry Baby. The Empress? Empress is, um, pretty good. But I think it might be kind of negated with the uh, Book of Belial. Not sure about that, though. We'll just hold on to 48 hour energy. Although I can't help but feel like 48 hour energy 48 hour energy is a little useless. Oh, god. The devil. That's a book of Belial charge. I, I thought I thought I got it mixed up with the uh what's the other one? Whatever one hurts everything. Death. That's what I got it mixed up with. 
Is that the converter? We also have blank card. Which is interesting. Um, hmm. Blink card is not really that important right now. I guess we could... Uh, lard. HP up. Mm, I can't really say that's really the thing that I wanted. Maybe I should have left that on the ground. May, uh, hopefully we'll get, at least be able to trade away some of that HP. We'll be able to take whatever we want from a devil deal when we find one. Black Lotus. Nice. More HP up that I'm not sure we actually needed. Wow, sirens are uh, going crazy out there. Don't know if you could hear that. Probably can. Always sirens going on. Playing that, I guess. Didn't really mean to. I'll actually take that dark bum. Might as well top off our red heart reserves. I don't even know if I want more red red heart HP. I think we're better off leaving some slots open for black hearts and soul hearts, just because we have a reliable way to generate those, and we don't really have a reliable way to generate red hearts. Well, we do with with little Chad, but he's kind of playing off the dark bum deal. And we also have a uh, what's it called? Gimpy, little Gimpy, whatever the hell. That is, so it's also going to be giving us back red hearts when we get the chance to. Have we got everything on this floor? Yes, I believe so. We're leaving behind the 48 hour energy, but who cares, really? Let's just fight Mom and get this over with. I don't think we're in any kind of time frame for boss rush. I'm not going to check right now, but actually, you know, I will check right now. No, yeah, we're way past that mark. 30 minutes. This run has already been super long. This episode is super long. Thank you if you're still watching. You're a true trooper. A true fan. Oh, just run right through that guy, I guess. Damage is awful. Awful damage. Mmm, mmm, mmm. -mm. Well, you know, what does the what does the negative do? I'm thinking about that because we're going to be taking the negative. I, the Polaroid gives you invincibility when you have, uh, like, half a heart left or something. What does the negative do? Does it even do anything? I feel like it does not. Maybe it's an evil up? The negative should give you a damage up, I feel like. A little bit of a damage up. That would be cool. Make it a little bit more useful. I saw somebody on the subreddit, Binding of Isaac subreddit that is, suggests like, if you take the negative to the chest, or I mean the cathedral, or you take the Polaroid to the dark room, I mean chill, getting them all wrong, what the hell, where'd that bomb come from? You would uh, be able to go to like purgatory or something, so that would kind of maybe influence whatever item you took. This is the pact, definitely taking it, oh wait no, it was contract from below. Uh, still, still happy with that. Contract from below is going to give us some good items. Hopefully. Curse of Darkness again. I can actually see with the brightness setting I have, so it's not bad. Don't really know if it was worth it to pop in here. We'll see what that card is. That could, that could change my tone. What are we doing on this floor? This floor is going to be the floor where we fight. Uh, no, this is the womb one. The womb one. I was thinking we're fighting Mom's heart in this room, but no. Uh, two spades. Shit. Got hit in the process. Just go ahead and duplicate our bombs or our keys or whatever the two spades did. Not really the best card. I was hoping for like a devil card that we could have used on the. We could have used the devil card. Or not the devil card. My bad. The uh, Joker. Joker would have been cool to use on Shield to get a little extra Devil Deal, but it's okay. You know, I wonder if we will get a Devil Deal on Shield because we have Goathead. I don't, I don't, I don't know if it works like that. I haven't uh, done any testing that I remember from that. By the way, what's up with this room? Four Monstros? That's crazy. Not too hard, but we took a little bit of damage. Still doing fine though, as far as health goes. 
Velastasis, not an issue at all. Dry Baby helping out a bit. Speed things up. Gotta use Dry Baby as much as I can. He's a very good item. Just gotta get him in the way of those shots. Somehow, he's getting hit. I don't know where he's getting hit from, though. Some red hearts on the floor there. Dark Bomb hopefully paying out. Yep, there we go. Keeping us topped off. We're, we're basically, we've got a lot, of, a lot of HP, and it's restoring, regenerating at a pretty good rate as well. We also still have regeneration, the literal power-up, I believe. So if we ever do leave, lose our soul heart shielding, we'll be able to fall back onto our collection of red hearts. This is like just the right amount of red hearts. I don't really want too much more. Wouldn't want too much more. Still hope we can trade some of it away, though. Oh, shit. A lot of unnecessary damage. Let's get some of it back, though, please. This will take away a little bit of our health, but... I don't know, maybe it's not worth anything. Well, you know, Mask of Infamy is not terrible. It ends up blocking some shots. Hmm, two troll bombs. Great, just what I wanted. What do you got for me, Dark Bum? Pay out with something good. Yeah, just like that. We will go in another curse room if we find one. Well, we're not going to find it on this floor, but you know. In the next floor, since we got plenty of HP for it, in all honesty. Still haven't got many damage ups, have I? I don't think I've gotten, like, any damage up. Bad gas. Pretty useless. I don't know that I can actually even find a... a, uh, black market this late. What the hell? The Emperor? That's really useful. I'll keep... I'll hold on to that. Let us uh, fight the boss on the next floor. Not the next floor, probably use that on the dark room. For sure we'll use it on the dark room actually. Damn! Fuck this. Let's buff, up, buff ourselves up a bit. These dudes are firing so fast! How the hell do I get down there? It must be back this way. been exploring a lot of this floor. What the fuck? Alright, could definitely use a bit more HP now. No? Okay. Okay. Fistula. Just want to speed it up. We kind of really kind of rely on Book of Belial with our damage output being so low. For the tougher rooms, or the rooms I don't feel like sitting through. No payout, Dark Bomb? Really? I've got a hunch it's over here. Special heals really helping us in that situation. Thank you. Hey, look at that. going on, man. I can't even... I, I completely forgot we even had Curse of Darkness right now. That's how that's how much adjusting the screen brightness helped me out. Happy I tried that. I never had thought of that. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Whoa, are you kidding me? Look at this fucking room, man. All these dudes. Speed up this, speed this up a bit. I don't want to be sitting in here forever. Holy shit. Wow. We're gonna sustain a bit of damage, I think. I don't anticipate me... Oh, okay, maybe maybe we can clear this up without taking too much more. That was, that was difficult, though. Dark, Darky, come on, take that. Where, where are you at? There you are. 
Excuse me. It's unprofessional burping on uh, Let's Play. Sometimes you just gotta let it out, though. I'd say that's an okay trade for a bomb. Not gonna do much else with those bombs. And finally, the boss. But let's use this real quick. Nah, useless. I don't know what I thought I was gonna get there. Maybe a I am error room. I don't know that I've ever gotten an I am error room yet on uh, Rebirth. Oh shit, I uh, probably should have charged up my Belial, Book of Belial, before fighting these dudes. Probably gonna take some damage. Some more damage. Yeah, I, I anticipate kind of coming out of this a bit damaged, but, yep, there, there, there it is. However, uh, we'll pick up a devil item from the Fallen, and then we're going to get a devil deal. So that combination is going to hopefully give us some damage up finally. Holy shit. If we survive, that is. I don't know, man. Get in and take that real quick. Gonna be on low on HP if we do trade it away. Shit. That was a hard boss. A very hard boss. Oh, almost went down there by accident. Sin up is exactly what we needed, though. Ceremonial robes. Oh, shit. I don't want you just to shadow, man. Oh well, that's that's useless. That's really bummed me out. Curse of the maze. Uh, that damage kind of bummed me out too, but a lot of a lot of red hearts there. Bit of a recharge. Let's um, I guess let's play this dude for a second. Kind of a waste of time, actually. Let's just donate some of our money to this slot machine. We got so much of it. Man, nothing's coming out. That luck down pill we got must really be affecting us negatively. There's something for Dark Bomb, though. Nothing, man. Uh, just an RU wizard. I actually want that. So our HP situation is already recovering, which is uh, nice after we sustained so much combat damage on that boss. Just keep circling here so this eye can't laser us. Oh, I was like wondering, like, why are we not shooting them? But it's because we it took that uh, I'm a wizard pill. That sucks. All right, finally our shots are straight now. Oh, what's back here? Check out the secret room. We've been in like almost every secret room that this uh, this run has to offer. No good items have been found in there, really. We'll go in that curse room. Got plenty of health for it. There's even more health. Blastasises. The Blastasise. Blastasises. I don't know, man. Dead. No? Dark Bomb? No? Man, that luck down, huh? Oh, wow. Hey, we could just skip. Um, we could just skip Mom's Heart altogether. Let's, uh. I think. I think maybe we should do that. Um, why do we really need to fight Mom's Heart, and what else can we find too much on here? Let's just go down. Did we, what did we, it's like a triple shot going on there. Was that from Rainbow Baby? No. 
So yeah, I'm pretty happy that we guys have just skipped that. Oh! Oh, Infamy guarded that shot from us. We will save the Emperor card for the final floor. Still, still do have Leo, although the effect is gone now. Since we got the robes on. Whoa. Loki, not too big of an issue. Hopefully on this floor we'll be able to find one of those red heart rooms just to buff us up a bit with some soul heart action. And still no, still don't think I've had a damage up. Ceremony robes does give us a damage up though, so maybe that counts. Fuck you, Dark Bum. Come on, man. I don't need that right now. Barely dodging. Just keep an eye on everything that's going on. Oh, shit. Charmed man. Thank you, uh, Skeleton Dry Baby. Thank you for helping speed this up a bit, maybe. Doing damage to everybody. Take some more, please. Please take some more damage. Yeah. Dark Bomb chasing after that red heart. Let's pop this up. I don't want to deal with this for too long. Plenty of red hearts dropping all over the place. I like that. I like that a lot. That must be our contract from below. Oh shit. You know, I'm pretty confident with the outcome in this run. Uh. We got enough health that I think we can kind of just muscle through everything that we come across. I'm taking, I'm playing pretty bad though. And our damage is low. I don't know, I don't know if I can call this a one run. We're going to be able to skip a lot of the dark room though, so that's going to be good. We'll be able to skip all of the dark room. Where's uh, Dry Baby getting hit from? Sometimes when he activates I don't, I don't see what's going on, but it's okay. I was trying to like shoot around that rock, but then I remembered I have special tears. Does Dry Baby not get affected by the laser beams? I feel like he does not. Man, running straight into that, that's not good. I've not been able to locate the secret rooms. Shit. Come on, pay out, man. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Where the hell is the boss? Down here somewhere, I guess. Hey, there's a secret room. Finally. I feel like we're going in the right direction, just because there's a lot of the map down here. Usually, the map doesn't continue too far in the wrong direction on these floors. Could get super unlucky, though. Have to backtrack all the way. This is not the top secret room, but it will allow us to bomb our way into the curse room. Don't need any more money. A little extra health doesn't hurt anything. Oh man, these fuckers. Don't have quite enough speed to be dodging them effectively when I can't see them. Usually if you just run around in a circle fast enough, you can avoid getting hit by them, even though they're invisible. Hey, actually that's a good use for our money. Hopefully he'll give us something. 
I guess I'll take it at this point. Um, actually, a little bit of extra HP isn't too bad. Since we're not we're not really staying at the cap. Anyway. Fuck this room, man. Right before the final boss, seriously. Uh, just, just let me... It's not the final boss, actually, but... I just want to fight him. I don't want to mess with these ghosts. Hey, at least I didn't take any damage. Well, not yet, at least. I know we could go fight the boss right now, but I sort of want to go over here. Yeah, yeah, that's why. Because I thought we'd find the secret room. And hey, there's a judgment, too, so... That's nice. Are you a wizard? Look down, look down, and... Wow. That was just bullshit. Let's play Judgment for a second. See what he gives us. A Hagalaz rune. Don't need that. Some little... Some food for Dark Bum. Yeah, I guess we'll just be rolling with uh, with the, with that HP situation we just made for ourselves. Mm, no bomb. I don't want to use the bomb. I guess we'll keep our one bomb. Well, it doesn't really matter. We're not going to have a chance to blow our way into a secret room anyway, seeing as we're going to skip the whole next floor. Let's see if we can make it out of here without taking any damage. That'd be ideal, going in the uh, lamb fight with full health. Nope. Well, there's a there's a hard back at least. Oh hey, what the hell? I forgot to use my book of Belial. That's nice. Nice little present. I did. I forgot about it. Dodging like a motherfucker right now. Keep it going. Almost at the third phase. Once you get to the third phase, it's a walk in the park. Taking so much damage, though. You know, we will do a few rooms in the dark room just so we can buff our. Uh... Fuck. That's a lot of that's a lot of damage we're taking. I do want to get a charge for the Book of Belial, so we will do a couple rooms. How are we getting hit so much by those feet, by the way? It's no bueno. Got a little bit of health back. It's concerning me a tad, though. What the hell am I getting hit by? Gotta pay attention more. Wow, now we're now we're low half. Oh, we're super low on health. This isn't looking good. Playing bad. Not paying attention. Getting forced into tricky situations. Hey, but at least when we get hit, we're, like, making up a bunch of HP anyway. We got the Fanny Pack, which is a chance to drop Red Hearts when we get hit. We got Gimpy, which is a chance to drop uh, Soul Hearts when we get hit. And, look, no Devil Deal. Oh, well, didn't think we were going to get one anyway. So, yeah, hopefully we can keep our HP up. <coughs> Excuse me. Nothing too good. Hey! Look at that, though. Nice. We'll take this. Uh, this is kind of, you know, bizarre. Late game like this. Uh, not really worth taking the nail. Although, it would give us a little bit of HP. Not, definitely not worth taking uh, nine, 9 lives there. Just get rid of a lot of our red hearts. Shit. Oh, holy, holy dick. That was upsetting. However, we made some of the HP back up. I think we'll probably... What will we do here? Will we fight the haunt and then just peace out to the boss? I think maybe that's what we'll do. So we'll have, we'll have a Book of Belial charge and we'll have enough HP. I think we can do it. I think we'll be able to do it. Let's do it. Bring it on the lamb. Bring it on. We're not doing so much damage. Hmm. We're doing a lot of we're doing a lot of little damage. That doesn't make any sense, I know, but 
think you get the picture. Almost halfway though. Doing good so far. Let's keep it up. Oftentimes I think the uh, dark room itself is harder than the boss fight though, so that's good we didn't have to fight most of the floor. This is our first piece of damage. Uh, Dry Baby's paying out a lot, I like that. Put a bomb in there. Not, didn't do that much. Slowed him down a bit. Boom. No more bombs left, oh well. Still doing pretty good HP wise. We charmed him, he's gonna hurt himself now. A little bit. He didn't hurt himself that much. Is he hurting his body? No, not really. Oh man, we're so low on HP! Two more hits and we're dead! Come on, gotta get it in there. Bomb down. He's, he's shooting himself! Oh, not for long though. The body's dead. Oh shit. Dark bomb. No, I should have taken that heart myself. Oh no, we were so close. I can't believe I ended up losing. Oh well. Hey, if you enjoyed this like 1 hour and 30 minute video, <laughs> hit the like button. And if you want to see more Isaac every damn day, hopefully I don't die in the future. I guarantee I will though. If you want to see more Isaac every damn day, hit the subscribe button. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Peace out. Oh, oh how do I...